If you couldn't tell from all the traffic around town, it is Miami Art Week, bringing artists from all around the world to South Florida to showcase their passions. Oh, yeah. From a maze taking over the sand to a subway cart taking over Wynwood Walls, I have some of the most unique galleries and projects that you're going to see, and even with some with a political message. Florida has been officially taken over by art lovers. Miami Art Week has galleries that stretch from the sand to land. We're starting off on the beach with one of the biggest public art projects at this year's events. We all heard of corn mazes, right? But what about a sand maze? Well, I'm here to tell you it does exist. And of course, it's here on Miami Beach and you can experience it during this art week. I would love the maze to function as a space for people to escape to disconnect, um, to come here and connect with others. It's called Maze, journey through the algorithmic self, made of 11 miles of linear plywood and covered with three coats of sand. The AI Maze sits on the beach outside of the Faena Hotel and is free to visit. The AI Maze is the first maze designed not to get lost, but to find ourselves because we probably are quite lost right now. Local artists are getting their shine this weekend, too. In Wynwood on 26th Street, Bleacher Report is showcasing five NBA teams, including our Miami Heat. It's on wood. Miami native um, Koval so was selected cool. to create a piece that will be sold on shirts. I was like, well, how can I make Bernie more of a character? Because, you know, it's a flame holding a basketball. And so, like, in my traditional illustration style, I like to create characters and monsters. And so for that piece, I kind of just wanted to pay homage to Bernie. Around the corner in Wynwood Walls, a subway has been taken off the tracks and traveled from Chicago to Miami. The subway kind of sits at the core of the street art movement. It's where it really all began. And it was a way for artists to kind of paint and have a larger audience because the subway would travel throughout the community. The subway is just one new activation here. Wynwood Walls, which is open year round, is known for being the largest street art museum. This is a place of hope. This is a place of color. This is a place of inclusivity. This is a place to explore and wander. New murals go up each year during Miami Art Week, some with a message like this one titled, Say Gay. I just wanted to create something that was, has a subtextual commentary on what's happening, but also just to represent queer people and free love and like openness. Wynwood is a place that celebrates art, it celebrates public art, and it, Wynwood Walls really, really celebrates street art in particular. All right, so guys, all of those events are open throughout the entire weekend, but for more information on these events and others happening this weekend, just visit our website, local10.com.